Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Global Online University. Here we are with our UGC NTA NET 2020 Paper 1 uh, practice questions for the topic Research Aptitude. Now, let's uh, go ahead. And there is an announcement for every one of you that Global Online University has came up with practice question MCQs, which will be for Paper 1 uh, and daily at 8 a.m. in the morning as well as 8 p.m. in the evening. And this pattern will go on till the exam continues. At the same time, we have a complete course for Paper 1, which consists of 60 full syllabus tests a full syllabus notes, video lectures. You can avail this facility by downloading an application that is Global Online University. And you can also join our WhatsApp paid, uh, paid WhatsApp group, which is the contact details given below. And the fees for the same is triple nine only. There is an important announcement that we are starting with our new batch from 2nd May 2021 for WhatsApp. So all those who are interested can please contact on the given detail and uh, can get the further information or if there is any query, you can solve it. Uh, start karte hai hamare aaj ke video se. That is the first question jo hai. Uh, for research is which of the following options are the main tasks of research in modern society? Abhi ye modern society mein sabse important tax kya hai? Kaise kya objective hai? So what are the options to keep space with advancement in the knowledge? Yes, ye to hon, that is ye to important hai. To discover new things, yes. To write a critic on earlier, no. Hum critic mein interested nahi hai. To systematically examine and critically analyze. Yes, we are interested in this. That is the sources. So, if you are watching, what are your options? Kya hai? 1, 2, 4. So, here is the order. Alag diya hai. 1, 2, 4 is your right answer or is your right option for this question. Next is a common test in research demands priority on what? Ki agar ek research mein aap test kar rahe ho, so it demands priority on exactly what things? So it demands priority on objectivity, yes. Usability, yes. Reliability, yes. So option is the right option is all the above. Hindi medium students ke liye question Hindi mein reflect ho rahe hai. So please try to read it or understand karke answer correct answer tick ki jiye. Next, what do you consider as the main aim of interdisciplinary research? If you have interdisciplinary research, then what is main objective? Kya hai? To bring holistic approach, to reduce emphasis, to oversimplify the problem or to create a new trend. So obviously, if you are interdisciplinary, if you are taking a lot of disciplines, ko leke agar research kar rahe ho, uska aim is one that you need to bring a holistic. Holistic is a whole. Everyone takes one approach. Okay, it's a single approach. That is called as holistic approach. So the right answer is option number A. Next. One of the aim of the scientific method in research is one of the aim. Agar aap research scientific methods se research kar rahe ho, to improve data interpretation, no. Eliminate spurious relations that is ambiguous or you know, uh, jo, uh, it, which is not important. So yes, that is the option. Confirm triangulation, introduce new variables, no. It is about to eliminate, to remove the spurious relations. Okay, so the main aim of scientific research is which relations are spurious, you have to remove them. The option number B is the right answer. Then, the depth of any research can be judged by. If you want to research any research, then what will you do on the basis of title? Objectives, expenditure, or duration. Definitely, expenditure or duration is not the title. Se zyada, kis mein, uh, look, uh, that is, depth research kis se pata chalega. It's based on the objectives. So, the right option is option number B. Next, research can be conducted by a person who has studied research in methodology, who holds a postgraduate degree, who possesses thinking and reasoning ability is a hard worker. Now, here definitely not B and not D. Students here confuse that A is or C is the right answer. Now, see, research karne ke liye, 
आपके पास एनालिटिकल एबिलिटी होनी चाहिए आपके पास यू नो लॉजिकल थिंकिंग होना चाहिए रीजनिंग एबिलिटी होनी चाहिए सो यर बेसिकली इट इज वॉट इट इज टू पॉजिस थिंकिंग एंड रीजनिंग एबिलिटी रैथ देन स्टडिंग रिसर्च तो यहाँ पे राइट ऑप्शन क्या है दैट इज योर ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर योर आंसर नेक्स्ट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट इज करेक्ट नीचे दिए हुए स्टेटमेंट में से कौन से स्टेटमेंट करेक्ट है ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ रिसर्च आर स्टेटेड इन द फर्स्ट चैप्टर यस रिसर्च मस्ट प्रोसेस एनालिटिकल एबिलिटी यस वेरिएबिलिटी इज द सोर्स प्रॉब्लम यस सो यर इफ यू सी द डी ऑप्शन दैट इज ऑल द अब ऑप्शन इज द राइट आंसर ओके नाउ नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर एट The next is which of the following is not the method of research? Methods we have studied methods of research. उसमें से हमने बहुत सारे methods देखे हैं. So yeah, I have a slide for you people. यहाँ पे types of research दिया है जहाँ पे qualitative research है, quantitative research है. We have content analysis. We have cause experimental that is cause and effect. Okay. We have correlational research, survey research. So यहाँ पे in this if you see All the research methods are included over here. Okay, that is observational, hai, historical, hai, survey, hai, philosophical. Hai. So, which is which is the odd man out? That is observation. So, option number A is the wrong answer. That is observation. Next is research can be classified as the same question. Hai. It is related to the same question. So, it is basic, applied action, quantitative or qualitative. Philosophical, historical, survey, experimental, or all about. So the right answer is what all about. That is option number D, which is basic, applied, action, qualitative, quantitative, philosophical, historical, survey, and experimental. The next one is the first step of research is what either selecting a problem, searching a problem, finding a problem. or identifying a problem so basically the first step of research will start with what sabse important hai identifying a problem after that that's what you will do is that after that you will select research on it and then you have to study but basic is what identifying a problem so you are the right option is option number d that's all for the day we'll be meeting with next video on the topic research aptitude and most probably in this weekend we will be doing a 50 question revision test for research thank you everyone